Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at the difference with Intel HD 620 graphics between single channel and dual channel memory. Uh, we're using Unigine Heaven, uh, same as our i3, i5 and i7 comparison uh, to show the difference here. And we are using the i3 7100U both in a HP laptop with a single 8GB uh, DIMM module and a Dell laptop with a pair of 4 gigabyte DIMM modules. Now, the laptops are very similar, both 15.6 inch, um, both i3-7100Us, identical driver configurations. Um, there is potential for some other differences uh, just by virtue of them being slightly different machines and firmware, but both are using DDR4-2133 memory. And with the test as we've run it, we see um, the frame rate increases from 18.4 frames per second with the single channel memory to 23.3 with dual channel memory. Um, that equates to 26.6% faster with dual channel, which is quite a nice improvement in performance to have. Um, it isn't as much as we saw when in the past I've tested HD 5000. Uh, that was with DDR3 1600 memory and also lower detail settings in this benchmark. So it's possible either that the higher detail settings have um, limited performance perhaps in shaders so we're not seeing as big a increase in performance going to the dual channel memory setup because something else in the GPU is limiting things uh, more than we were with lower detail settings on HD 5500. Um, it's also possible that the difference has shrunk because we are using higher speed DDR4 modules. Um, so it may just be simply we actually don't need that much more bandwidth over single channel. Um, so we aren't seeing as much of an effect. But even so, it does show why it's quite annoying that laptop manufacturers have sort of taken to this trend of not fitting dual channel memory as standard into their machines and instead just going for a single DIMM. In fact, the Dell I'm testing with uh, originally came with a single 4 gig DIMM and I added a second one to give me dual channel 8 gigabyte setup on that. So something when you're looking at laptops to consider if, if you want to get sort of the optimal graphics performance out of it, take a look and see if it's using that single channel or a dual channel configuration in the memory. Unfortunately, a lot of manufacturers don't specify this. Dell did, HP didn't. Um, so it is worth looking at what you're getting before you buy. I hope you found this video useful. Um, be sure to check out the other videos on my channel for a lot more gaming performance testing on Intel HD 620. Um, subscribe if you want to see more videos as we post them and let me know in the comments below what you'd like to see us testing in the future. Thanks for watching.